before we get to the recipe, I will attempt, note I say attempt, <laughs> to show you how to uh, open an oyster. Although this technique will not be used today in our preparation of our Rockefeller. Now we call this kind of the, the uh, poor man or the broke man or the, you know, dude who don't got no, dude who don't got no um, <laughs> uh, oyster glove, way of opening oysters without your glove. Um, take the pointed end and just kind of slip into the hinge here. I wrapped it with a towel. Oops. And twist. Just a little bit of wiggle and twist. See how that just pops right open? And we're going to cut that connect that uh, connective tissue up top. And voila! You have a shuck oyster. <laughs> Woo! That's beautiful. Now, a lot of times, um, if you're in, how does that look? Mm. I may share a recipe for a homemade cocktail sauce as well. Hey, babe, want an oyster? Yeah. It's ready for you. Quiet on the set. Well, I've still got zucchini and some ideas that you can do with those. Do you like oysters? Lisa and I love them. One of our favorites is Oysters Rockefeller. I'm going to share with you a recipe for making Oysters Rockefeller. What I'm doing here is just simply brushing the oysters with my oyster brush to get those uh, shells clean. And as I clean them, I'm going to put them on a bed of ice just to keep them cool until we're ready to work with them. This recipe is kind of simple, kind of easy. It's not quick. However, I think it's one you're going to really enjoy once you see me put it together. And then you can make Oyster Rockefeller anytime you want. They smell good, so let's pull them out. Uh, it was four after when we started them. It's 16 after now, so what's that? Uh, 12 minutes in our toaster oven. I'm going to turn it off and just take everything out. Oh, those are beautiful. Looky, looky, looky. Mm. Oysters Rockefeller. Today we, of course, harvested our zucchini. Then we uh, made that little side dish, which I absolutely love. Uh, I hope you enjoy this version of Oysters Rocky. Um, remember, it's about love. Peace, spread love. If you've got questions, you can email me, chef at curtisakins.net, or like I always say, put it right there in the comments. If you like what we're doing, tell a friend or three. Peace, spread love. Hey, baby, I think they're ready. In fact, I know they're ready. It smells so good. The little bubbling. Ooh. Want to try one? Yeah. All right. We'll let these shells cool off just a bit before we jump in. Mm. 